एक ब्लैक कलर की तो गई है एक ब्लैक कलर की तो गई है काफी देर पहले गई है फिफ्टीन ट्वेंटी मिनट्स Alright guys, so this was our campsite, and this is where our bikes were parked. We're trying to get them out now. Engines are warmed up. And now it's my turn to take the bike out of the compound. Very sweet people. They agreed. to let us pitch our tents here last night it was chilling cold in the night all right so this is the road that leads to spangmik or pangongzo lake and we are going towards that the first ray of sun i can see on that snow capped mountain over there we came this way last night map gone crazy completely all right so shock durbuk this way map is malfunctioning say spangong lake So the dashboard of my bike is reading 8 degrees Celsius. That is exactly what it read when we were crossing Khardungla. So you can guess what kind of temperatures it would be out here. I have worn two layers of jacket other than the riding jacket. So yeah, I am safe inside the jacket layers, feeling perfectly comfortable. married diverse feed sun is hitting us right on the face and that's also the first ray of sun that's falling on us another 103 kilometers to the pangongso lake road is hilly don't drive silly massive these mountains are just massive the size of these mountains cannot be determined on any video or photo you have to be present here to actually experience how huge these mountains are ये 
एक ब्लैक कलर की तो गई है एक ब्लैक कलर की तो गई है काफी देर पहले गई है फिफ्टीन ट्वेंटी मिनट्स Just look at this water. It is so blue that it almost feels like someone has added some dye into this water. It's that blue, surreal, unrealistically blue. All right so this road is under construction as you can see and we were said that this road gets blocked after 9 am in the morning though we started pretty early but yeah took some breaks and we got late it's 9:25 right now and we were let go so no issues there bhai main ek saath is bridge pe nahi chadhna chahunga ye log nikal jaye pehle अरे लो बैटरी बोला सीना तेरा ही बोला क्या ठीक है रुक जा रुक जा रुक जा रुक जा Almost every water body in this region, the Ladakh region, is absolutely blue. It's blue in color. And it is crystal clear. You can literally see the bed of the river or the lake, whatever you are near. Four K. All right, so we are entering Durbuk, another small hamlet on this route. Another 2.5 or 2 kilometers. All right, so we just crossed Durbuk and there was a Y junction. We took the left towards Pangong. The right goes to Karu, and that's what we're going to do tomorrow. Right guys welcome to Tangste beautiful mountains straight highway gunning towards Pangong and a little bit of traffic here and there beautiful tarmac so we just got network at the place we had stopped before i started recording this video and uh, i just dropped a few messages here and there that we are fine we did not have network since yesterday and now spangong time train hard fight easy there is this strange uh variation of the geography here you can see grasslands beside the river flowing by all through the way that we were coming there there were no grasslands or any part of grass but here it is there very strange the way the geography changes uh it's very very 
quick and very very diverse see it's grass everywhere now beside the river how cool is that although there are rocky mountains all around beautiful scenic beauty grasslands on our right snow capped mountains on the top and those are basically glaciers and then the rough rocky mountains beneath that beautiful contrast beautiful hues amazing The first view of the world famous Pangong Lake right over there. Absolutely stunning. Right, the beautiful blue Pangong Lake right in front of us and the road towards Pangong is this way. We came through this road. Probably we could have taken the upper one as well. But that's okay. Let's try out this off-road section and try to reach Pangong as soon as possible. Spangmik is the place where we are looking out for this day let's see how it goes traction control off Alright guys, so this is our stay in Bangong and this is the Pangong Lake right in front of us. We'll just try to go near the water as near as we can get. There is that three dates point and stuff. So we are going ahead towards Man and Medak. Let's see if we get a good point. We'll stop for some photography. I'm panting because I just pushed my bike off. So we just emptied our uh, jerry cans onto the tank. So no more jerry can business now. At least till Karu. The bike is feeling fairly light without the luggage. Although Harish is sitting behind. But he's probably lighter than my luggage. <laughs> 